Many people who function as channelers report the experience of receiving information from some other intelligence. And sometimes they will give this other intelligence a name or they receive a name by which this other intelligence wishes to be known. Many ancient cultures have at their heart the idea, the principle of there being a universal mind in which all of us participate. So for example, within Hermetic philosophy, there's frequent reference to something called noose or an infinite or universal mind. Within Vedic philosophy, reference is made to something called Akasha, which in a Western context, the earliest such references appeared in the book Isis Unveiled, which was published in 1877 by Madame H.P. Blavatsky, a world-traveled Russian occultist and religious spiritual visionary. She wrote that there exists this ethereal substance that records and preserves for eternity all human events, all human thoughts, all human interactions. And starting at that point, that term really began to enter into our common vocabulary and entered into Western culture. 